As cases of RSV, the flu, and COVID are increasing, so are concerns about treating secondary bacterial infections children can develop that require antibiotics like amoxicillin. Ohio Senator Sherrod Brown has been vocal recently about a nationwide amoxicillin shortage that's sweeping the nation. In a news conference on Wednesday, the senator discussed a bipartisan letter he and several colleagues sent to the Biden administration. In that letter, he urges the president to address the ongoing amoxicillin shortage. Senator Brown says no child should have to wait and that it's, quote, past time to take steps to ensure there is enough amoxicillin to go around. Frankly, these large drug companies have outsourced so much of their drug production because they don't want to pay American workers wages. They want to find cheap wages in other countries and then they blame everything else. Unfortunately, the American public and children in this case who need amoxicillin um, to just to stay healthy or to stay alive um, are paying a price for, um, for the greed of American drug companies. The FDA recently added amoxicillin oral powder to the drug shortages list, citing an increased demand. The FDA says it's working with approved manufacturers to help prevent drug shortages.